college seminary and college, uh, I found very similar. Uh, you still have a dorm room. You may or may not have a roommate. Um, I had a roommate my first year at the university. Um, uh, I didn't in college seminary. But then when I went to major seminary, because we were so full, I did have a roommate my first year. But um, class schedule is the same, except obviously you're incorporating prayer and mass every day, uh, holy hour. I would say the thing that surprised me the most, and it was most important for me to understand and learn, was that just because I was going to the seminary, especially going to a college seminary, just because I was going there didn't mean I had to be a priest. It's the best place to go and discern and figure out, is this what God wants you to do? Um, it's better than spending a year at home with your parents and praying and working. Uh, it's better than just trying to figure it out on your own in the midst of, of the world. It's a great place to get a good education. It's a, I, call, I tell people it's a win-win situation. You go to a college seminary, you get a great education, you end up with a bachelor's degree if you uh, haven't gone to college already. Um, if you don't go on to a major seminary and are doing a priest, you're still ahead because you get a great education. We hope that you're a more active and, and, and zealous you know, Catholic in your faith. Um, and if you do go on, amen. You know. You're on your uh, uh, continued path and studies for the priesthood. Uh, the biggest surprise for me, I thought that the day you entered the seminary it meant you had to be a priest. And I can look back now and say, no, the seminary is just the best place to go, and that's how you really can discern, especially college seminary. Don't think that you have to be a priest just because you go to the college seminary. It's just truly the best place to discern and figure out, is this what God is calling me to do and be for the rest of my life?